I have hung innumerable drapes <laughs> for her, and it's not something I want to do, but it's, uh, told her she I would. She got me this day. I told her, yeah, she got me today. I told her I'd do something nice for her, so this is what she wanted. So we're going to show you how we do it. Okay, we're going to make the drapes to barely skim the floor. That's the way I like them, too. So we're going to measure. They're 89 inches. 89 inches puts it real close to the ceiling. I forgot my blue painter's tape, so I'm just going to use this electrical tape. And what we've got to figure out is exactly where to put these brackets on the wall. So we're going to have to put the rings and the hooks and the curtains and hang and hold this rod up to see just how it Okay, we've got to estimate um, where I'm going to put the brackets in the wall. I just want to show you, okay, she's putting her pins in about two inches down from the top of the curtain right here. And when you do that, you put it, put that on there, what you end up, is you got a little space here you got to work with and it looks like the top of this bracket is about going to be about at the top of the curtain so that's where i'm going to hold it and then we'll fine tune it once once we get it up on the wall okay we're going to go ahead and put all these hooks in in the curtain and also all the rings on the rod and then we're going to hold it up and see where we're at Okay, the bottom of that piece of tape is about where we think we need the bottom of the bracket. Okay, we're going to put the brackets an inch outside of the window frame. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and put the one bracket up on the left. Okay, I don't know if I'm going to hit wood or if I'm going to hit plaster, so I'm just using a bit in case I hit wood. I'm going to um, just use a bit a little bit smaller than my neck. Okay, I put the screw to go right there. I'm just putting that one screw in, and then I'm tightening the brace down. Down. I did run into wood, so I just need to use the screw itself. That way I'll be able to adjust it. I'll do both sides with one screw here. We'll do the fine-tuning adjustment, and then I'll put the screw in here. So you can see there, I still had some adjustment up or down. But as it turned out, this is exactly the way my cousin wants it, so we didn't have to adjust anything. Now, normally you would put two screws in there, but these curtains are pretty light, so I'm just going with one screw. Okay, the, the way you can either put all of these hooks on a ring, or the way to professionally do it is you get an eye hook, you leave one of these hooks free, and you get an eye hook and you screw it to the wall and you connect that to the wall like that. Okay, when we on the other side, uh, apparently they didn't make the drapes exactly the same length and the other, the, the left side then was too long. So I used my adjustment screws and we raised up the bar a little bit. So got it to looking pretty nice or really pretty. Now I'm going to do this side. I've just measured from the ceiling down to where this is on the other side, and I'm going to match it on this side. It's seven and three quarters inches. On the other side, when I ran into plaster, I had to use one of these things here, and just use um, the bit that's a tad bit smaller, or just exactly the same size, and then. If if it's tight, pounding it in, just put the same bit in and ream it out a little. You don't want your hole oversized. Okay, so I'm just going to hold the bracket up there and I'm going to do a top hole about a quarter inch down or a little less. So it's adjustable. I'm using a 7 16 bit in case I run into just wood. Okay, I didn't hit wood. It was just plaster, so I'm going to use my 3 16 drill drill bit. Okay, I ran into wood on this side, so I just screw it in with the power driver, then I can fit my bracket, and fit my bracket over it, then tighten it with a hand screwdriver there. 
Okay, we got these hung over here too, and um, I did have to adjust them just a little bit. Now, um, my cousin said that when you put the pins in, that the top of the curtain is supposed to just ride along the bar there. So she she redid over here. And that's what she tried to do I don't here. Know, supposed to just skim the edge you know but those yeah, yeah those are pretty good so she's gonna redo these to lift them just a little bit higher but for me if they were mine they would be fine for me but they are really nice and we got them just skimming the floor <laughs> 